Hello, my lovely Marshall Blanders. How are you? How are you? So today I'm going to talk about my two favorite chelating shampoos. Mizani Formula 7. It's kind of hard to get, so you have to look for it. I, I get, get it from Walmart online. That's how I get it most of the time, is through Walmart. Um, but there are other places you can go. But Walmart is the one that I, I tend to find it. And then Aveda Shampoo. This one I do order directly from Aveda themselves. Um, I love their shampoo. It's wonderful. It really does remove the dirt and gunk that's on top. And it does remove the things that are inside of the hair. So that's what a chelating shampoo does. It really does remove all of the gunk. So whatever service you're gonna do, be it a blowout, whatever styling you're gonna do, whatever treatment you're gonna do, a chelation is a wonderful way to prepare it. It's also good if you're going to dye your hair. So it's also another good preparatory step for color. Obviously you would shampoo with the chelation 24 hours before. Um, so those are them. Aveda's shampoo. And this one is my personal favorite, Mizani Formula 7. So this one is also a normalizing shampoo. So after you do a, a color process, not let me correct myself, after you do like a lightening process, and that's what I mean, a lightening process or a relaxer process, any chemical process, you follow up with that and that will really normalize the hair, it stops whatever the chemical reaction is. The reason why I say not a color process is because it is a chelator. So if you use it after a color process, it will strip. It will remove that color. So you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. All right? So, But after a lightening service, yes, because it will clean the hair out well and it will stop the chemical process. Now, as far as hydration for the hair, I like this as a synergetic treatment. So the purifying shampoo, it says it's an intense cleansing shampoo, shampooing profound. So it's a deep cleansing shampoo. It probably is a clarifying shampoo, but it really does work almost like a chelating shampoo. So I know for some people a chelating shampoo strictly has to include removing of metals which by definition that is what a chelating shampoo does it removes metals so that's probably why this one is not marketed as a chelating shampoo but it does remove a lot of other stuff from the hair so but that one and then you follow up with the hydra fuse so essentially you would use this one after doing the shampoo you would put the person or yourself under a processing cap for about 40 minutes. Let it sit, then you wash it out and you style as proceeded. The hair will be hydrated. It's a wonderful, wonderful treatment. So those are the things that I would say for hair today. <laughs> so my favorite chelating shampoos and my favorite hydrating treatment. So if you feel like your hair needs hydration, Hydrafuse. Use the purifying shampoo and then follow up with the Hydrafuse from Mizani. So I hope this helps somebody. If you have any suggestions, write it down there. I'm always open to learning. And goodbye, my lovely Marshall Blanders. I'll see you. See ya.